Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be doing my birthday haul. Yes, my birthday was last weekend and as a real diva I celebrated for the entire weekend, Saturday and Sunday, because why not? One day is not enough, we had to do two days. <laughs> so anyway, um, I'm gonna share with you a couple of things that I have received and a few things that I bought for myself because, you know, it's like my birthday is always an excuse to treat myself to something, right? So um, yes, as I was teasing you on Instagram, I did receive a new handbag and it's from Gucci and I'm gonna show you at the very, very end, which I'm super excited about. That was a gift from my husband. And uh, if you don't follow me on Instagram, maybe you should. <laughs> I will leave all the info regarding my Instagram in the description box so you might find me over there quite often. Um, all right, so let's start from like a couple of cosmetics, beauty stuff. I have a one pair of shoes and I have some gold jewelry, real gold jewelry, which I'm super excited about. And uh, we're gonna finish with a handbag. So let's get started. Chanel. I went to my local Chanel, Chanel counter. I was looking at those new eyeshadows and blushes, but mainly eyeshadows that the Chanel released recently. I think this is their like a fall collection, I believe. Um, but obviously I'm always late and I never kind of follow everything on time. Uh, so I went to my local Chanel, you know, counter just to kind of ask. I really didn't think she was gonna have anything. And you know, the eyeshadow quad that I really wanted she didn't have it anymore. I think she had one of those with this kind of like a bright kind of green and red color bur burgundy. That's just not me. Um, but I managed to get a few things, She, which were to my surprise, you guys. Uh, I'm gonna show you very quickly. She did have the blush that I had from the new collection that I actually had on my wish list kind of, you know, but I wasn't like, if I can get it, that's fine. I'm not gonna cry over it because I have quite a few Chanel uh, limited edition blushes, which I love. I absolutely love those limited editions. So I was really surprised that she had it and that was the one that I wanted. Um, this was the, this is the like a rosy mauve color. Um, it's called a blush harmony. Yeah, beige rose more mauve. mauve. Anyway, look at the packaging, how cute. So it has this limited kind of, you know, uh, colors on the side. The compact itself, you know, with the velvet, it's all the same. It's a classic, you know, kind of a Chanel compact. Comes with, I've been using it quite a, for quite a few days. I have it on today, by the way. Comes with that um, quite use, useless kind of moon shape uh, brush. And this is the blush I'm talking about. <laughs> It's absolutely beautiful. They came up with two. There is another one that is more like a terracotta, um, but this is the one I thought if I buy, this was gonna be the one, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Look how beautiful it is. I know this, this entire design will disappear soon, but I mean, it's so cute. It's really, really, really nice. So I use it for a few days, and um, I have it on today you have to be light-handed. I don't know how it's gonna look on the camera, but I noticed that the first uh, first time that I use it, I just put away too much. I look a little bit like a clown and uh, I've learned very quickly. <laughs> a little bit goes a long way. And you know, each blush will be different. The pigmentation will be different, but I'm glad at least I was able to get this one and you know, these last for a very very long time unfortunately i don't think it's available online if it is i'm gonna try to link in the description box but this one is it's hard to find um so <clears throat> what i also picked up let me show you guys this is hold on what's the next? cleansing oil okay this is the cleansing oil so Basically, it's um, this is gonna kind of melt your ma makeup. You put like a pump or so on your hand and you kind of distribute it all over your uh, face, including your eyes, and it's just gonna break your makeup. And then obviously you have to wash it, um, you know, do the, I, I double cleanse anyway. Um, this one had amazing reviews online, so I've decided to pick it up at the store since I was there. And um, so I'm looking forward to use it. I did not use it use it yet. I am about to finish up my 
uh, pharmacy, those little um, jars with the, the cleansing balm. So I have probably about two, one or two uses left. So I will be using this one um, soon and I will definitely report uh, what I think about this. She also gave me a bunch of samples, but I was really looking forward to try yeah, this one. She was really talking a lot about this. Let me know if you guys know this. This is the newest mask from Chanel. I think it's pretty pricey. It's like 200, I think 30 or $20. Uh, but she was really talking a lot about this mask. She gave me quite a few samples and she said you just put it overnight and you just sleep with this. So I didn't use it yet. I have three of them. I'll be definitely trying this. And then she gave me a couple of um, you know, those fancy submelage, submelage, I never know how to say it. Um, I think this is like an eye cream. Yeah, the eye cream and the face cream. So she gave me a couple of these as well. So about a month before my birthday, uh, the Dior Beauty uh, sent me email about, you know, happy birthday, blah, blah, blah. It's a birthday month. Uh, here's the special code you know to get this beautiful pouch you know with your beauty purchase and you know those are a few things that i wanted to buy from dior anyway so i took advantage of this and again if you I've seen my uh, Instagram stories post. You've seen what a fiasco it was. Um, they sent me this. It was two about two weeks ago. Yeah, I, I paused it and uh, they packaged. I'm gonna show you guys. This was the pouch I was talking about and I know this was like very popular and very limited edition and I know they had like similar one over the um, summer which was like a bigger one I think with this zipper this is like a raffia kind of a material and this is literally like a clutch you have like a little zipper in here I thought it would be great for summer you know generally I wouldn't carry this like to the fancy spot but I thought you know like the summer would be nice and I'm gonna pop the picture the way they packed this um, that's which I posted on Instagram I was so upset you guys I literally kept this pouch to keep it nice and straight because it came all bended i it still it still has a little it's still not completely straight but it's much better i kept it under heavy 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 books for literally two weeks okay i literally just took it out before that video so it looks it's much better shape but still there is absolutely no excuse for dior to pack the pouch like this you know they should have just used bigger bags because this is the box they used and as you can tell the pouch is bigger than the box that's why they had to kind of you know um jam it in which is i don't know i'm just so disappointed you guys this is just ridiculous but anyway i call them i complain obviously they told me they don't have those pouches anymore so they cannot replace it with anything else and blah 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 we apologize no, that's that's not enough. So anyway, let me show you quickly what I've got. I was looking forward to order their new fragrance, which is called the Dior Rivera. Dior Rivera. Dior Rivera. Sorry. <laughs> Um, but then, you know, I could have selected this as a sample, which I did, and I thought to myself, let me just try it first before I order it. So I got this deluxe sample of that fragrance, and let me tell you guys, I don't like it. So I'm so glad. I don't know, there's something off about this. I just, yeah, it's weird. Let me know. Do you guys have this? Have you tried this? Did you buy this? Did you use it? Do you like it or is it just me? I am not a big fan. Yeah, Dior Rivera, Dior Rivera. I know this is like, they had like this whole commercials and everything, but I'm glad I didn't order uh, a full size because I would not, I would not like it. So um, yeah, this was one of the samples, but I am tempted you guys to buy this Jador Lore and there is another, J'adore. There's two different ones. Yeah, this is the newest one. This is um, this is the newest one. So I have this sample and I, I did try this one. So it's really, really nice. So anyway, this was the samples. The two things that I've ordered from them, one is from the Prestige line and one is from the Capture Total. So let me show you Capture Total. I did finish recently 
the prestige lotion that I used every single morning after I washed my face which I loved and it lasted me for oh my god like a year and a half because you just need a one pump it was such a great lotion um, so I wanted to pick up two new lotions basically so this one is from the capture to town this is the intensive essence lotion I didn't uh, use uh, looks like it's thicker I didn't use any of them yet I'm trying to finish my YSL so let's just try it together let's see I don't smell much but okay so it is you probably won't be able to tell it is a little bit um, like a thicker you know kind of a uh, consistency yeah I can I can smell the fragrance <laughs> yeah it doesn't have too much of a smell but uh, it does have like a tickle thicker um, consistency like a little bit substance and you can see if I if I turn it around you can probably tell that this is not just like watery it has um, you know has like a nice substance to it so I'm looking forward to try this I'm just trying to finish up my uh, YSL um, dewy drops I think it's called which I have very little left so because I know myself if I open the new ones I'm gonna start using the new ones but I'm just I'm just forcing myself literally to finish so um, another one is the Dior Prestige and this one is lotion uh, micro nutritive probably butchering the name of it but say it's brand new I didn't open so we're gonna do it together very bougie packaging as always from the prestige line and this one oh yes <laughs> look at this beauty look how pretty the cap I mean they have a little star I mean it's absolutely gorgeous so I guess is this how you open it looks like oh has a nice it's a nice rosy scent and it is again it's it's quite substantial oh I love that smell this is very nice it feels so nice on the skin yeah oh I'm so looking forward to use it but I just have to finish the YSL first yeah I feel like both of them I feel like both of them are really really nice I'm just kind of surprised there's nothing am I doing something wrong why there's no pump I don't want to break it but I feel like I'm doing something wrong <laughs> but anyway um really nice i'm looking forward to use it i'm excited to use it and i'll definitely let you guys know how i like these um these boat lotions now because it's my birthday month and i am a gold member um of the beauty tier something <laughs> i don't i don't know what it is beauty insider something it means you spend too much money i spend too much money um you get a birthday gift which is supposed to come today so if i get it before i edit this video i'm gonna insert it now okay guys so this is the birthday gift that i have received from dior as a gold tier member um so this is the notebook that just came today this is all um paper in here by the way um in case you were wondering the notebook itself is is plain there's just the white um you know papers in here and it says dear on every single page here on the bottom so it has a little bookmark and it's all nice and gold um so i think it's pretty use you know useful gift i think it's pretty nice i do like that print and it's pretty cute so i'm sure i will be using this so yeah i'm pretty happy with this when you're a platinum member your birthday gift is different i don't really remember what is the what kind of a gift is this year but i'm gonna show you what i've got last year because i don't think i ever show you guys and i feel like it was just such a ripoff they gave me the their candle this is the 30 montane uh, that's like a classic I guess that scent the real birthday gift was just no more available by the time my birthday came in September and because of the pandemic and you know all that mess they didn't get shipment they didn't get anything so they were like pretty much just giving those candles away and to these days you guys I didn't even burn this candle I'm gonna tell you why I mean the packaging is beautiful look at this I mean it's absolutely gorgeous um, 
there's a little that doesn't even have a cup can you believe it i mean such a nice i mean nice looking candle but doesn't even have like a legit cover which is a bummer this is how it looks inside it's a little bit like a blueish kind of a tint and the reason i don't burn it because it stinks <laughs> I don't know, I'm being so critical today, so harsh, but I don't know, it's kind of like a little pepperminty like a scent. I don't know, maybe if I burn it, maybe it's gonna be different. You know, I shouldn't probably criticize it, but uh, I don't know. I don't know, I was, I was just disappointed. I was absolutely disappointed with uh, that birthday gift, so. Um, and I think originally there was like a nice brush hair kind of set you know that i was supposed to receive but anyway um so yeah um one more thing from dior i'm gonna show you very quickly last uh month or was it in maybe it was in july i think it was early july i when i became the i was ordering some you know some stuff as usual some foundations and other stuff that's how i reached the um, gold tier so they sent me the gold gift and I didn't show you guys. So, so let me just show you because this is actually nice. This is actually really cute. So this is like um, this little packaging, little box, and it is magnetic. And when you open it, look how cute is this. And you actually have four, um, four fragrances in here. So there's a little uh, J'adore, okay? So there's another one, another J'adore. Uh, so I can I didn't even use it. There's another one. So each of them is just slightly bit different And this is I believe it's a lotion. So it's like a little j'adore Let me see if I can keep it open. So you have two just, just different, you know different kind of scents so you have two in here and then you have one more in there and um, I Think this is the lotion for the for the body. So it is very cute. I have to admit that this gold uh, gift from Dior. It is very cute. Obviously, you can display it or not, <laughs> whatever you want to do. But um, yeah, I was actually quite pleasantly surprised, you know, to receive this. So I'll give them credit for this one, but I'm still kind of mad about my um, last year birthday. But anyway, let's move on. I got myself a new pair of shoes and uh, it wasn't planned. I just, when I went to Chanel, you know, boutique uh, in the Dillard's and then I went kind of upstairs, you know, to check the shoes and I spotted those some Edelman shoes and I just had to buy it. I'm just gonna show you these. These are so super cute. These are current collection. Look at this. Look at that shoe. I mean, it's just stunning. Absolutely stunning. Let me show you another one. I, you know, and I, I thought to myself, these are gonna be perfect for you know for my performances uh to wear it on a stage but not only you know i could certainly um wear it you know even outside if you know if i have some events to go so important um you know things to do um yeah this is the the back i think this is all leather it's really really beautiful i think some adelman shoes are just like amazing these are like one of my favorites and you know this kind of style reminds me a little bit of the dior kind of mary jane shoes that they had it like last year um and then you have those little like a button details in here i mean absolutely gorgeous i think they also come with um non-patent version i'm gonna link them down below for you guys because this is just I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. They, um, I wear them true to size. This is eight and a half. Um, so yeah, and there's like a little detail also here on the back. Um, yeah, so I'm super excited about these shoes. What do you guys think? Let me know. <laughs> and the the and the heel, you know, is not too crazy high, so it's still comfortable. I have those Gucci shoes that I got um, from my husband. I'm gonna say eight nine years ago. Um, they are beautiful and they have like a very crystal beautiful GDs on the front which I wear on the stage all the time for all the performances so but it's nice to kind of have you know a little variety I don't really always want to wear bling bling <laughs> and it's funny because you know whatever I have my friends or people that know me sitting in the audience they always say that even can see my shoes sparkling from the very last uh, balcony you know in the concert hall so I was like yep those are my Gucci crystals so anyway um, you know these are just gonna be amazing I think for performances and uh, uh, and not only so I'm looking forward to use these very soon 
next weekend is the opening uh, season. We are opening a new season with the symphony, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna wear these. So because I like to spoil myself, and especially uh, for my birthday, I was really looking forward to buy myself a nice gold bracelet. Now, this is the one I wear 99.9% .9 of the time. This is, and you guys always ask me about this, this is the Tiffany. This is the gold Tiffany bracelet, which I've got, I think it was four, three, four years ago. It was right when the whole thing started. I treated myself for my, in the spring for my name day, and I have been basically wearing it non-stop absolutely love this um i don't think they make this anymore because you know tiffany will have their little um designs and then some of them just kind of go away so but I had, they had this for a few years you know before they discontinue absolutely love it so um you know i just want and i have other you know obviously gold bracelets but you know i just wanted something new so anyway i went on Etsy and I found this beautiful, beautiful bracelet from a jewelry store uh, in Turkey, Inst Istanbul. Um, they actually have quite a few amazingly skilled um, jewelry, jewelry <laughs> on Etsy. Uh, they are from Turkey and, you know, there's from different countries too, but um, you guys, <laughs> I purchased this bracelet for myself. Let me show you up close. Um, this is 14 karat gold, solid gold, just I want to make it clear, solid gold uh, bracelet which I purchased myself. It was expensive, I'm not gonna lie, but it is absolutely beautiful. I want you to look at even the inside of the of the bracelet. Do you know how nicely finished it is? I mean, and if you go around the bracelet, that's basically, you see it all over. And it's a little bit more narrow here on this both um, sections here. And then it gets slightly wider on here. So it's, I mean, attention to details is amazing. It's absolutely beautiful. There is a clasp right here on the side, which it's pretty tight, so you open it, and the whole bracelet is there's a little spring which is right in here. So you know it's 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 really sitting tight. It's it's gonna be almost impossible, you know, to lose it. And it's it seems like it's it seems like the clasp is pretty tight. So um, I feel like it's super secure. I will put it on my hand so you guys can see it. Um, I've been already wearing it for a few days, and I just love it. Um, there we go. So this is how it looks on my hand. I am just, I am blown away of how beautiful this bracelet is. It's absolutely gorgeous. I ordered this in a size small. They have it from extra small, extra small, small, medium and large. So there's four sizes. And of course, you know, um, depend what size you have. If, the, if you go bigger, um, the price will be slightly more expensive. It was expensive, just. Uh, but I'll, I'm gonna link this exact bracelet from that exact store down below in the description box. Um, you can send him messages. He's very quick to reply. The shipping took about like three days. Amazing, just amazing. Um, and they have such a variety of, you know, different jewelry. They only make uh, solid gold jewelry, nothing, um, you know, that is uh, gold plated or gold filled, you know, because you've seen a lot of those. Um, so I feel like they're very honest people. I even ask him about the weight of the bracelet, you know, and all this. So obviously the price of the gold is very expensive these days. So, you know, I think this was thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars So it is an expensive, um, you know, um, bracelet, but I would highly recommend. And they have so many different designs. And even if they don't have anything like listed, you can ask him, he will send you photos, he will show you, um, you know, other designs. So yeah, I am so happy that I've got this one. And you know, I can, cause I, <laughs> I've been wearing this one like literally nonstop. I think I have to give it to Tiffany to, um, I think I bent it the wrong side the other day also. So they will have to maybe like, I think they can do it, right, the Tiffany? Um, you know, just kind of 
just kind of give it a little bit reshape to this bracelet but at the same time you know I can always switch I would not wear them together I'm not into wearing um, two three or four you know bracelet like you see on other people I'm, I'm just not into it I like to wear one at a time even when I have a watch I don't wear you know bracelet on my watch so it will be just one at a time <laughs> you'll never see me you know wearing 10 bracelets I just don't like that look so anyway yeah so this is my new bracelet and I, I am absolutely loving it so you guys let's talk about the Gucci the final gift that is from my husband came in this box and when he asked me originally like what would you like for your birthday I, I there was really nothing that I had specifically on my wish list and uh you know I told him like you know there is this one handbag that I kind of like but it is very expensive and I don't think it's worth the money but he was like just send it to me just send it to me the link you know so um I did send it to him and he and I'm getting this back for me, which I have been wearing it for a whole week already. So uh, let me just show you guys. By the way, this is the this is the proof of purchase. It came with that, you know, that little green envelope. Um, they included. Let me show you guys quickly before. I, they included like this little baggie. It's like a little uh, kind of linen bag. It says Gucci in here. So this was also. Here's a bigger one. So this was also included. This is the dust bag that the handbag came in. So let me show you guys. Like I said, I've been using it, so it's all packed. Dun, da, da, da. <laughs> so this is my new Gucci bag, you guys. I am obsessed with this. The moment I've received it last weekend, I have been basically wearing it nonstop. I am so into a small bags these days that um, my large like see the never falls I have it right there these are usually I grab them uh, when I go to work because you know I like to take my water bottle and you know some music and other stuff so I'll usually use my bigger bags when I go to work but on regular like everyday basis you know when I don't have to go to work I use small bags and I'm just loving this one I'm just loving it um, I am I like this combination, you know, of this kind of, uh, I think they call it webbing, yeah, with the canvas, and this is the coated canvas, obviously. This whole bag has uh, leather trim all around here, and it comes with this uh, super thick canvas strap. And notice that the strap has a navy uh, and red colors, and this webbing is the green and red color. So it has a two different color combination, which again, I really, really like it. I think it's awesome. And um, you can obviously take the strap off. So let me show you guys very quickly. It also came with another strap, which is included in that little cloth. Let me just... So it came with this uh, wristlet strap. So basically, if you don't want to use a big strap, um, let's say you go for like an event or an evening, you can just wear like this. So you can just use it as a little clutch and you can just have it as a little wristlet or you can just hold it like that, you know, or whatever. But yeah, it did came with that extra, you know, a wristlet strap. This is the bag that I tried on in Poland <laughs> over the summer. And I was like going back and forth, back and forth. And I was, when I left, I was thinking, so I should have just get this bag, you know. So anyway, this bag features obviously the uh, GGs right in here. And like I said, this is all coated canvas, all right? And then you have the webbing in here. The back is basically the same, except there's no, uh, you know, the logo in here. These are the sides of the back. Obviously the zipper goes all around and I'm gonna show you how it looks like inside in just a second. So it's a very small back. It's very, very small back. I think it fits even less than my YSL because the YSL is a little bit uh, wider in here. Um, but let me just show you guys what I have because I've been using it and this is basically what I What you would expect me to have in my handbag. So let me just show you. I do have my um, Chanel uh, wallet, which is the because it's considered a compact wallet, but the full wallet will fit here as well So I have this I have 
I have my Dior lip oil, which I absolutely love. This is amazing. I have my favorite Caudalie hand cream. I have my key in that little LV pouch. So these are my car key. I have uh, some papers, some tissues, <laughs> some, yeah. I have um, also the lip gloss from Chanel. And that's basically it. That's all I have. And the, obviously the font I'll put in here as well. So the inside is all like textile, like a little linen, kind of like similar to this. Um, so it's all linen and there's a little pocket here in the back. It says Gucci made in Italy. And let me open it. There's a credit card. <laughs> Two credit cards. Oh my God, I'm such a mess. <laughs> okay, I have a bunch of these papers. Gucci, 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 Gucci. Why did I put three? I have no idea. I think they're all the same. But anyway, um, you can easily put like a card holder in here. You know, like a small, one of those smaller card holders. It will fit, but you can just put it in there or, you know, like little things that you need to carry. So yeah, the back is very simple. There's really nothing, you know, um, fancy about it but I really like this because I feel like it's uh, giving me like such a sporty sa sporty vibe and I feel like it kind of goes with what I usually wear which is jeans white uh, navy blue and what I love about this that reminds me so much about the vintage Gucci and I feel like this will never age I feel like this will be always always popular you know what I mean um so yeah I'm, I'm super super excited about this uh I'm gonna link this exact bag down in the description box keep in mind that the zippers are a little stubborn and I'm gonna blame it on the fact that they're new but they are just do you feel it how kind of like you have to work it out maybe I have to put some wax paper on it uh, but there is basically two zippers and they open all the way around so it's very easy to access you know the the handbag also i wanted to mention the strap you guys is adjustable so um see i can still move another inch or two down and i have it set up pretty low i could go much higher so the entire strap is adjustable is there any markings on it um, yeah, the markings are only here on those clasp, on those, um, yeah, so you can probably see it says Gucci right in there, but I don't see any markings on the, on the letter sections. Oh, there's, um, yeah, so basically just the hardware, see there's, so just the hardware has a markings, but there's no, nothing nothing says here on the on the leather parts yeah and obviously you can probably use this with some other gucci bag if you have i don't really have it do i have it i have the one that is from gucci outlet which i uh, wear whatever i travel because it's such a great travel bag so um i don't think that um the strap is not removable in that bag so anyway so yeah i had this big tote that was just like that ophidia tote which i sold quite quite some time ago so i was really kind of missing this you know this kind of color scheme this vibe of this ophidia line so um yeah i'm super super excited you guys about this and i'm you know i'm gonna wear it now like basically all the time um this might be replacing my beloved YSL handbag so yeah I'm kind of I'm kind of excited about this let me know what you guys think do you like this bag I think it's great like it goes even awesome with the with the black oh, so nice so nice so I think this is it <laughs> that's it for today you guys whenever I can I will link down in the description box so check it out also don't forget to follow me on the Instagram and uh, thank you so much for all of you who wish me a happy birthday a week ago on my Instagram and uh, yeah I really really appreciate it so um, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video bye